You can slap him. What? Two. Wait. One. You. Oh. <laughs> That's three. Hi everybody, it's your girl Tofu. Today we are back with some Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 3. Let's get into it. This looks problematic. Today we have Polka with us. She's a ballerina bunny and she's super cute. You about done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, right <laughs> thanks, here, Sarah. I'll keep look out for you too. Um, Very kind. Okay. Troy, get him tied up. Troy's nice. Will do. Interesting. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? I used to have a walkie-talkie like that. Oh, really? What happened to it? Because you can't have this one. I used it to talk to my parents. Is that why you're looking at this one? Do you want to call mom uh. or daddy? I don't need it anymore. My parents are dead. Everybody's parents are dead. That don't make you special. Okay. My dad's alive. <laughs> Not for long. And we're all grateful for that. <laughs> Get the girls in back with the rest of them. We got a bit of a drive ahead of us. Are there snacks in the truck? Yeah. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey! Did he hurt you? Hey! Hey! Hmm. Oh my goodness. Kenny. Oh. Does she have a nose piercing? All right, we got to do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. And what, hey, jump Clint, out? Help me find something to get these off. I don't know. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that? Just gonna do? jump out of what the, the hell truck? Is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. Like what? What do you mean, like what? Something sharp. Anything that can help. A, a fucking. I don't know. Anything. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Sit that. down, Kenny. They took everything. Mm. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill. Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. I think he's a little paranoid. Say that again. I'd stay out of this boy. Ooh. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're he is kind of a boy, though, because he, we have been asked by so many people to keep an eye on him. Like he's a child. When Clementine's a child. Whatever. He is a boy. Whatever. Man. You don't understand. He's different. Oh no. The fuck are you talking about? 
He wants to punish oh, us. Oh no. What do you mean worse? He's a fucking psychopath now. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really Oh shut up. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Mm. Something that he seems to be missing. Oh, sorry. The in-game volume is probably really shitty. Let me let me see what I can All right, that should be good. It might be too loud now. I don't know, but it, it was probably really quiet before now, huh? It's probably going to be louder now, huh? Yeah. As a capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with it. Oh shit, jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know me. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Mm. We've all been prisoners. Why do you think we left? Kenny's right. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. I trust How Kenny. Is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here. Clem, the adults oh. are talking. Is oh, don't give me that, sense? sir. All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with So let's open people. it right now and just leave. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned uh, No. Us. Come on now. You don't know that. I know <sighs> he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us He behind. wouldn't. Luke is that gonna come back. A flake. I could tell the Kenny, I no! <laughs> Kenny, please calm down, please. Kenny, I love you! Sorry. Don't make- I look angry to you? Luke will help us. Oh yeah? When? After that crazy fucks killed no, us all? No, he's nice, I swear. Kenny, please trust me. Hey, look, Clem. We're close. Damn it. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Okay. I love my boy Kenny, but like, I don't think that's a great plan. I think that plan could um, use some finessing, because as of right now, that's that's a horrible fucking plan. Kenny! <laughs> Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. I feel like Kenny's gonna do whatever he's gonna do, so I might as well help him, right? You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just... Yeah, okay. I trust you. Hope I'll, I'll do what I can. All right, it's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. I trust Kenny, right. but I don't think it's the best plan. Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Oh, wait a okay? fucking second. I think so. Oh, what hit me? It's probably for the best. Okay, interesting. I did not expect that. <laughs> I guess that resolved well, I guess. We didn't have to put ourselves at risk to go with Kenny's plan which was kind of mediocre at best goddamn brakes ain't working for shit all right up and at him oh it's that bitch Fuck. how'd you get your restraints off oh, come no. here we've got some familiar faces back with it's us. that bitch the bitch who was recruiting now, yeah i understand some of you are that's her right yeah it totally is I think I've got an idea. Might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. Be patient with them until it does. Take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make Is that just like a warehouse? It's just like a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what to feel. How much food they I have, have no idea how to feel about this right now. Like, that sounded like a pretty, like, nice speech, right? But we all know that, like, Carver doesn't appear to be the greatest guy. But then again, like, I don't really know his side of the story either, you know? We'll see what happens. Okay, okay. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Many of you already know a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we need you for something. Hmm. 
Can it wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. I don't want to be mean to her, you know? It's just gonna make it the, everything worse. When? I don't know, but he will come back. Oh, what if he doesn't come back, though? What if they're about to slaughter him? Oh, we just lied to her. Oh, no. Make sure y'all stay off the fence. We will can see if you're messing with it. He's still jabbering. My goodness, that's a long speech. Thanks, Mark. Wait, wait, wait. What was that? What was the exchange between those two? Hmm. Interesante. Y'all best get some rest. There ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. Doing what? That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold. But at least I'll be comfortable. Hey guys. Reggie! <gasps> Wait, where's your arm? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. Lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This hmm. happened well after you guys left. I guess I should Reggie helped us. Okay, help him when we ran away. <sighs> What happened oh, maybe she won't know. I don't know. Fuck. We were all running out to Yeah. Him, but then he fell. And everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. He said it happened oh, after, though. Working outside. Luckily, yeah, okay. Snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. Hmm. That's awful. I'm so Did sorry. Did she fuck him, too? Look, or? It was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Okay, what? sorry. I don't want to slut shame her. She can she can sleep with whoever she wants to sleep with. Go her. Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be fine. Mm. Let's see what he wants. Hey. Ridge. Oh. Hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. So nice. Don't mention it. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, right. Let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's You're Rita. so happy. Hello, Reggie. And that's Kenny. Hey, uh, I don't trust happy people in this game. Who are you? Then again, Omid was fine. You out. It's okay. Freaks me out too sometimes. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Maybe he's genuinely nice. Hey, where's mm. Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? <clears throat> Well, that's that's unfortunate. Yep, yep. Can you guys <laughs> save it for the morning? Who's that? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. I thought it was Lee for okay, quite two Mike. seconds. He's kind of a dick. Me. <laughs> but, like I said, he saved my life, so. I put up with that shit. <laughs> Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Hmm? <coughs> the girl over there? Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. <laughs> He's like gossiping, I love this. Camp covered in guts and just like the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stay. 
I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Rich. Why did we try to no, leave? No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh So what's food. the catch? The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced <laughs> labor, but that's <laughs> temporary. He's so optimistic! He's like, through forced labor, but that's okay! <laughs> this boy! They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? We just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making You sound brainwashed, out. sir. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. I know that, but I'm starting to see what this place offers. I didn't before, and with the accident, it's just that much more important now. Carver killed my friend Walter. Okay, I, I don't know what happened, but maybe he had his reasons. His reason is he's a crazy piece of shit. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please mm -hmm. just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. You have this water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Me. <laughs> All the time. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. He's just scared, I think. I think he's just scared. Everybody's scared. Ain't an excuse to sound like a nutcase. You gotta take a look around. <sighs> we gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. <laughs> Well, what should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference. Hmm, I don't know. I don't want to get Reggie in trouble. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking. There's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow. It moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Can't believe you survived. I can't either, honestly. But Mike killed the walker and took off the arm really quick, like he'd done it before. Hmm. It looks rickety. I'll talk to everyone in a second. I want to explore as much as I can before I talk to people. Guess it's better than the ground. Which begs the question. It's not. Oh. Oh, interesting. Why is she on the ground then? Is that like an upside down koi fish? I don't want to wake Mike right now. Can I go this way? Can I go this way? No, that's, that's yeah, okay. Can he? What? I'm just asking. No, it's okay. It's not my real name. Well, my boy's name is Wes. Pull on. I don't think I should pull on it, right? My name, so I told her it's Rajiv. Then I just stood there while a guy yelled Reggie for five minutes. And that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this.
I don't think I should pull it, right? This place seems pretty secure. Why would I bother pulling on it? Uh, just to alert them. Ooh. Ouch. I want to know what it's like. I just, I need more story. I don't, I don't know about Carver, guys. I, but I also want to know his side of it, you know? Like, I don't know. I don't hmm. reminds me of the jewelry store. Oh. I think that's all this way. Alright, let's go talk to people, I guess. Should I look at this? Because I I looked at that part and then it gave me the option to pull. I don't think I looked at this particular one, right? Or is it all the same? Wouldn't it be cold? They're like technically in the outside, right? Okay, it is different. Good. Interesting. Looks kind of crappy. I didn't treat him very well these last few weeks. Things got so complicated so fast. It became all about getting through each day. I'm trying real hard to remember the last time I told him that I loved him. Alvin? I've been racking my brain, but I just can't remember. I choose nice options, but I I'm think sure all the bad options. In his heart, I'm sure he. But knows. you could be nicer. You really I could. Hope that's true. I don't know. All right, get going. I'll be fine. I appreciate you checking up on me. Hormones can be pretty crazy in terms of mood, and she's got pregnancy hormones, so maybe I shouldn't judge her so good. harshly. What? Reggie asked me to be good, so I'm being good. I don't want him to get in What? Trouble. Like, talking to me is gonna make you bad? Like, I don't- I don't fucking get your logic here, sir. Woman. Girl. Hey, Clem. Nick? Just thinking about Lou. Just... There's no way he's gone. Don't I think he's him. doing something. I think he's gonna help us. Cause me... I've known him for damn near 20 years now, and I can't buy it. Of course, I can't say the thought never crossed my mind. Things change. The whole damn world changes. Uh, this is the more interesting answer. Yeah. Yeah, he's still out there. You watch. Why wouldn't he help us before we got here? I don't know. I just he's know got a he's plan. Out there still. He's smart. Smart. Okay, than me. so basically, Luke's going to help us, and then he'll finally win the respect of Kenny. That's what my prediction tells me. That's for sure. <sighs> Guess I'll try and get some sleep. You should too. We're gonna ride our asses tomorrow for sure. Okay. Night. I didn't get to talk to Mike Dad! or something like that. All right, go the fuck to sleep. I'm shooting the first one of y'all I see wandering around before oh sunup. My goodness. Troy, where's Alvin? Everybody get to bed. Oh, I think they killed Alvin. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. I don't know. You up for it? Sure, Kenny. It's your decision. I'll try. You'll do just fine. He's such a dad. Oh my sleep. god. <laughs> we'll need it. Daddy Kenny. <laughs> I get all the feels whenever he just interacts with Clementine. It's not that he's replacing Lee, but like they were of the same group together and I think they just like they've been through so much. There's just something so reassuring about being with someone familiar like Kenny, even if his uh, choices can be questionable at times. I'm not even sure we should try to escape until we really know what's happening, you know? <gasps> Don't kick me. It's rude. <laughs> Get up. Bill's gonna have to Might work. remember that. Hmm. <clears throat> the 
There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herd's moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now... <gasps> Where's Alvin? There are some folks might be sore about what happened and how things <laughs> went. Face. Well, that's all in the past now. Hmm. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness. By proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Reggie, you're nearly back in. Keep following the path and we'll welcome you back with open arms. How'd you sleep? Let Reggie be an example to I was all. so tired. Salvation is available, but I didn't even must realize be earned. That. Pay attention. Kenneth will be we'll taking over later. Reggie's okay. duties outside okay. the wall. Okay, yeah. Sounds good. Michael will continue on I showing his value. I just thought it was nice to finally... Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. I'm sorry, sir. No, no. I oh, no. Cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior oh, on day no. one of No. You discipline her now, no. Carlos. No. How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her Damn think it. twice before opening it up again. Wow, Carver's gonna be a great dad. Oh, wait. Wait. I'm not sure with my hand that I... Well, could... that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on. Not some mamby pammy thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit oh, out of her, God. then yeah. Go on. Let's Carlos. stick up for her. Just get it over with. It's my fault. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. Unless you want one of what she's about to get. We I'd could take it. I feel like Sarah can't. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. She just wouldn't shut the fuck up. Oh, God. This isn't, doesn't make it any better, though. I don't want to watch this, honestly. Do it. Uh, that was kind of hard if she fell down. Oh. You just got slammed. Oh. I'm sorry, Sarah. Stop. You're not cuddling that girl anymore. Let her <sighs> sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their okay. assignments. Okay, I wonder if like little bit by little bit we can see why each individual left. Because now we know why Carlos and Sarah left. But I don't really know why, why Nick left and Pete. I'm thinking that little bit by little bit we'll just like uncover why each person had their reasons for leaving. Because I don't know. I, I just think that's how it's going to be done. It's time to get to work. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. Are you going to make the pregnant woman work? Like You're working in the armory. Follow me. Wow. Oh. To think you were so nice. Boyle, up. Scared me. Oh, shit. Clementine! Hmm. Who is this? She's one of the new people. She was with Carlos and Sarah. Ugh, and... Sarah? I wish she'd stay gone. People. She's had a hard time, Becca. So have we. We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Huh. It's them. I remember them. Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. How do you feel, Bonnie? Are you gonna be nice or are you gonna be ho? Cause... Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. Oh, she feels a little bit bad. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I I feel so conflicted about Bonnie. I'm I'm really bitter with her. I suppose I owe you an apology. I Aww. wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. 
And I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks... Yeah, the one who helped you and is dead. I can't help but feel Whatever. Blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. It was just a bad situation. That got worse. A lot of people are to blame. That's big of you, but... I know what I all right, Bonnie. But I wanted you to know I regret my part in all this. I appreciate I your apology. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. Okay. Okay, Bonnie. I might forgive you. How was your first night? Not now? great. <laughs> I know it ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. Which is more than I can say about a lot of places. I'll out say there. I'm hungry. I was hungry. They didn't feed you? Bill said you'd eat every night. I haven't eaten since yesterday. I... I don't have anything. I'm sorry. Aww. I'm kind of glad we're with Bonnie, then. I was supposed then. to go. When Luke and Carlos and all of them left, I was planning on leaving, too. Oh, why? When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. Oh, why didn't I mean, you leave? We're safe here. We got power. We got why did you want to leave? And Bill, he... He wasn't always What like happened, this. then? Why didn't you leave, I mean? I'm being honest. I guess I chickened out. I justified not going. I feel time. like that's within character for Bonnie to chicken out. Yeah. Seen. Yeah. And yeah. So it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take the situation with the herd. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. What changed? I don't know. I've been trying to figure that out myself. I mean, and I ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't like <coughs> that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending what he did. That was- He did kill Walter though. Uh... I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. Sounds like you really respect him. It's not that. I just have sympathy for the man. Even though sometimes it's hard for him to do the same. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads. Then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Mm. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for skiing. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's cool. I like it. Well, I'm glad. I thought it was cute, but I it is kind of cute. You <laughs> I hate that I've forgiven Bonnie so easily. I, she's just, she's just scared. Kind of like what's his name, Reggie? I guess. I don't know. Reggie's like terrifyingly optimistic, but Bonnie, I, I, the fact that she knows what she did and she still tried to be kind, like I'm inclined to forgive her. Still think she's a little bit of a hoe, but I'm inclined to forgive her. <laughs> I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Remember how kind she was when she was recruiting? I feel like that's that's what happens with recruiting. <laughs> you're supposed to be kind and make it sound so appealing. You're supposed to sell people on it. Little do they know, it's actually horrible. I should have brought a snack. Why do I do this every single time? Follow me. Come on. Sorry, I was checking my phone. Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. <gasps> Touches everything. Just to piss her off. To be fair, she does need to grow up a little bit, hey. but I do feel sorry for Sarah. 
Ah, I don't want to give her a hug. Like she, she kind of needs to be tough right now. It's gotta be hard. My dad's never hit me. Well, it wasn't really him. He was forced to do it. Even when I was really bad, he never hit. He didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy, not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess Carver hit me super hard because it still hurts like Oh, yeah. <laughs> it looked like it. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep, no problem, <clears throat> Davia. Hmm. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. Hmm. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Hey, so... Is she gonna be okay? Because what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. I'll take care of her. You don't have to worry. Good, good. Cause I'm awful at that stuff. I but don't trust him. He's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. Mmm, I don't know. I don't I, I'm conflicted about him. <laughs> that was awkward. I won't do that again. I'm gonna go work. Pat now. pat. <laughs> I, that piece of dialogue right there. See, this wouldn't even be so bad. Like, working in the greenhouse is kind of fun. Sarah, get your shit together. Okay, okay. I'm a sensitive person, but in the apocalypse, like, I'm pretty sure, like, I'd toughen up real quick, you know? In order to survive, I'd put on a pair of big girl pants and I'd suck it up and make it work. I think, like, just in this situation, you should lose sensitivity pretty quickly. You just become desensitized to the shittiness of the world. But, I, uh, it's, it's not that it's wrong for Carlos to coddle her, although you guys know I'm kind of against coddling. Hashtag Rachel Amber. I think he did her a real disservice to raise her in this certain way during the zombie apocalypse. It just, he shouldn't have protected her to this extent, you know? But I mean, the whole slapping thing, like obviously Carver was way out of line with that one. But Sarah needs to toughen up a little bit. Look, she's just fucking sitting there. You got slapped. You just got slapped. Deal with it. All right. Let's fucking help Sarah, I guess, because she's a dumb bitch. You can't do anything for herself. Wow, it's like I've heard these hey. words before come out of my mouth. Here, watch me. This is what happens when you coddle your children. They can't do shit. I should know. I'm not a very independent person sometimes. This isn't that hard, Sarah. I know. I'm just afraid I'll make a mistake. Okay, well, it won't be the end of the world if you do. Just keep going. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Why is that oh, no? Just keep working. Why are y'all so scared? You didn't do any of your work, Clem. <laughs> just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. Reggie. Yeah, Bill. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bill, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy- I just have- I have one arm. Shut up, so shut up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. It, sorry, it's not funny. You better have an explanation for this. Let's step in. And I mean now. Bill, please, just- it Sounds just... like you're about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. We'll get it done. But just give us some more time. We just... It was my fault. I didn't show Sarah well enough. I guess. No, nah, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. 
didn't we? Crap. But you just don't get it, do you? Well, what, what should I have done in this situation? Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few oh. things to talk about. I tried. I don't want Carver more mad at Sarah. I don't know, like, I... That's where the help goes. Oh, no. What's wrong, Sarah? She's like, I've been coddled too much in my life. This is just all too difficult for me. Picking blueberries off a plant is just too much. Are you okay? Oh no. I gave you no, 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 no. no. Reggie, no, he's gonna fucking no. kill him. No. 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 Weakness. Incompetence. It puts us all at risk. And it won't be tolerated. You think about that the next time you're act to do something. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Could I have changed that outcome in any in any way? What's going on there? He's comforting Sarah, yet he Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Mm. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, okay. Okay, anyway, remember how Carver was first introduced? Like, it was imperative that Sarah was not found by him. So, what's the deal there? There's something, there's something fishy going on. And he thinks that Carver just gets a little bit possessive, you know? He's, he's either doing something really weird with Sarah, which makes me really uncomfortable, or he just thinks that this is his family, and that he's, like, the dad, and that these are his children, and he wants to be, like, the father, the person that everyone looks up to, and like Carlos threatens that dynamic for him, and that's why he wants Carlos to seem kind of like the bad guy, so that maybe, you know, Carver was seen as the good guy in Sarah's eyes or something, but there's something going on there. I don't like it. Hmm. Oh, hey, so they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to him. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's wrong? What's wrong? Reggie died. Man? You alright? You look like you've seen Drama! Ghost. Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. Oh, really, Bonnie? An accident, you say? Listen, take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to all yourself. Alright, alright. I need to go find out what happened. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna <coughs> feed them boys some nails. Alright. Go on. That ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Did no one from like Oregon or California survive the zombie apocalypse? Because I'm pretty sure only people in the South did. Judging by what I'm assuming is a slightly Southern accent. Hello, zombies. How are you today? Oh no. That. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn oh, Lordy, important. Kenny. Get your fucking hands off you me. You ain't gonna force me to do this bullshit. I said get your hands oh, no. off me. Or what? You gonna go tell on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why Let's distract them yourself? by saying Reggie is dead. You're one of them, aren't you? Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? What did you See? Distract them. Oh wait, fuck. Oh no. Oh, this is how we die. Oh my, very unfortunate. Oh lordy.
So lucky. Pick up the pick up pick it up. Okay, okay. Okay. What did we just trip on? Oh, oh, that's kind of a problem. I do believe we're about to die. Fight unfortunate. Fight unfortunate. Wait, why isn't this working? Why isn't this working? I'm pressing it quickly. I'm pressing it really quickly. What the shit? Why isn't this working? Am I just gonna be here forever? Like, what's the deal here? What is happening here? I don't know what was supposed to happen there to completely. <laughs> To completely honest, to be completely honest, I get up, get out of there, come on. Thank Make me save your ass. Jesus. Thank you for saving me, sir. Oh, thank God you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now. You think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Hmm. She walks so weirdly. Wait. Is this. It's Luke! <gasps> ah, ah, stop! Hey, it's me! Luke! Yes. Okay, one of you reassured me that it was like normal that some people in the fandom did shoop, uh, shoop, did ship Luke with like an older Clementine because, and that makes me feel really happy because now I feel like less creepy because I I'm not the only one who thought it. Okay, hi Luke. Man, bit the hell out of me. Thank you, drew blood. Come all this way. Hit him. Hug him. This is this. Let's hug money. him. And not in a, not in a weird way, just like in a it's nice to see you Luke way. We all were. That was good to see you too, kid. All right, listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. Well, this is the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but it ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. They plugged up all the holes we used when we got out. When do you think the herd will be here? I don't know. It's hard to say, really, but I reckon it'll wash over this place when it does. See, Carver? Oh, he ain't dealt with anything like this before. Mm. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but, well, we're in it now. It's what we got. We just... We just need a plan. No way to get you and, and everyone. Luke! Oh, sorry. Sorry. Shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem. I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with the guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're, they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. We just gotta be smart, okay? We gotta plan. Where do I get one? I think they keep them in the stock room. I ain't completely sure, though. Just keep your eyes out for the charging station. Put most of them back on there at night. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried that, uh... Get out where I can see you. Go on, get out of here. 
They always put so much responsibility on me. The hell were you doing? I got lost, sorry. Huh? Answer me. I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Hmm. Oh yeah, her name's Becca, not bitch face. Okay, it's Becca, right? Or Beck, something like that. Rebecca. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. Mm. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Just, oh, did he kill Alvin and that's why... Uh, uh, that Alvin, isn't it? Right there. God Alvin. fucking damn it. Wait, is he still Alvin. alive? He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Carver. Why are you doing this? Me and him, we got history. Understand? A couple things we had to get worked out. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Mm. Now. Carver's a hoe. We don't like him now. It's you official. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in You would chair. beat me? A little girl? Now you might not believe this. Ho! What happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let Why'd depression you sink him? in during times like this. You killed him, like but he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Okay, this is like the whole... Do you remember... Ow, fuck. Do you remember Molly and when everyone else with Lee and cancer people, they went to the school to get supplies? That was where that one group was that basically weeded out all the... The weak people from the from the people who are stronger and that just made for a really shitty community that's what carver's doing and i don't think that will ever work out well if you only keep people who are strong also that's not a great way to keep your leadership position if you want to be a leader yeah if you want to have power you need to have power over weak people but if you're just if you weed out all the weak people and you're just left with a bunch of strong people you can be easily overthrown from your position of power so honestly it's not in carver's best interest to keep killing off the weak-minded people because then you're going to be left with people like Carlos and Luke who are literally just going to like rise up and kill Carver like Carver you're a dumb bitch like you should know this anymore not with what we got at stake you have to be able to contribute he didn't deserve that even if he messed up he didn't deserve to die oh he certainly did I don't like your eyes. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. <laughs> That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. In fact, I think you realize... Okay. Okay, I think I know what he's referring to. Like, even when we're so young right now in this season, like, we're still kind of a leader. We still have to take care of people. And I think Carver sees that in us. But here's the difference. <laughs> you can be a good person and still be a good leader. You don't have to rule with fear. I, it might be effective short term, but it's never going to be effective long, long term. Eventually people will riot and they'll overthrow you. Like Carver sees our leadership capabilities, but like there is a huge difference between us, even if we're similar in that way with the ability to lead people. Like he's just a piece of shit and we're not. Like that's just like the simple difference between us. Okay. But you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, 
The next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Are you trying to adopt it's me like as your another another child right of yours? Way, the way my child will be raised. Oh, it ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. What if it's not yours? Ugh. See, I feel like that. Well, even if that was true, it's mine mm. now. All right, now. Well, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Try really knock the shit out of it. How bad is it? The rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Are you gonna kill Troy? Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Now we know where a walkie-talkie is, though. But it's in his office. Like, why would we get that walkie-talkie that's in his office? Honestly, a herd could, could could just destroy that fence so quickly. Cause we all know this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos. Y'all are talking very hits. loudly. No one will be paying any attention to us, and that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Kenny, do not speak to me like mm. that. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good But what if we're just going to get found again? It seems reasonable. Who knows when See, that like, I'm not even ready to escape yet. Like, I, there's just so much more information that I want to know. I still need to know why, like, I guess every single person escaped. I mean, I have, like, a good idea, but I just, I want the juicy details. There was a girl back at Crawford. Crawford, yeah, that's what it is. To send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. I forgot the name. It's, it was Crawford. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. There are a few along the roof. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back mm -hmm. then. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just got to get into his office. Why didn't you say something I didn't sooner? know it was relevant. Because it doesn't yeah. change anything. Okay. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, no. We're going to have to choose. You're real difficult to oh. Sometimes. Okay. No. That's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. Luke's in no shape to help us. You want to put our fate in that guy's hands, it's not happening. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind Compromise. Him. Yay! Okay. So we get that turd radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the She's not wrong. <laughs> Kenny can be a little impulsive sometimes, but he always means well, like in my opinion, I guess. If the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. First words I ever hear you say in this. I'm sorry to keep pausing. I just have so much to say. She reminds me a lot of Molly, honestly. Just like her demeanor and like kind of her attitude and like the way she holds herself. Like she reminds me a bit of Molly. I like that. I miss Molly. Just some crazy stupid <gasps> shit. Will we run into Molly later what on? Do you mean exactly. When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. 
Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. This is nuts. No, it's not. It's perfect. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the Marsh House. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Uh, good the fact that he talks about Lee. Right. <laughs> what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. My fucking heart! We still have to find a way to get in the stop -off. I got a plan for that too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Okay, so they call me kid, but they also expect me to do half of the shit for the entire group. Like discrepancy? I think yes. From We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock. There's shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't probably fall, won't fall to the dead. breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at her. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost your arm? <laughs> Come on, kid. I'm actually, it's so refreshing to Don't have to go. deal with Kenny's hot-headedness again. Like, I've missed this boy. question aren't there cracks between um everyone else and the people in like the prison area where they all sleep like i don't know i'm pretty sure there's like cracks in that doorway or that that thingy that goes down to separate them at night and couldn't they just see what these people they are doing i don't know that that that's just that's just me though okay okay i'll stop pausing i promise ow that are fucking hurt <laughs> Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you're not in your bunk, we're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. There's quite a few of them. Yeah, let's get Luke that radio and book it, cause... <gasps> I'm gonna get Taco Bell after this. I ate a salad for lunch and a protein drink for breakfast, okay? I deserve some fucking Taco Bell. Maybe I should eat, like, chicken and green beans. Or a quesadilla. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking quesadilla. Cheese and steak. Ugh. Wait, I don't think I can open that. In the parking lot? Yeah, fuck. I see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? Oh, he's gonna fucking see me. Yeah. How can I be? Oh, shit, we need to move. He's gonna see us. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. Think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we Bill are. Bill is we're not great. <laughs> we learned a lot since last time. Is it enough, though? We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what to do here. Are we gonna get seen? Because, honestly, I don't know what to do right now. Who? <laughs> I'd be so fucked in this position, honestly. There has to be something over here, right? Yeah. Shit, it fucking moved.
Let's shoot her. Yeah. Sounds like a great plan to me. How are we gonna get down from there to there and then back up there? Yeah. You think Bill? Go on. Uh, I was just. I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe. Spit it out, okay? I don't think Bill was gonna let him back in. Huh. You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. So, really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? What? I think so. The homestead, at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out there, just moaning. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figured we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. Fuck. So what are you doing tomorrow? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people. Turn it down. Make Did sure it doesn't make noise. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we Fuck. have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. She's gonna see us. She's gonna see us. There's no fucking way she's not gonna see us. It's gonna make a sound, and she's gonna hear it from up here. Oh, we're, oh my god. That was almost too fucking easy. Wait, no, someone's gonna come up from behind us. Like, that just seemed too easy. Wait, are you serious? We got away with that? There's no fucking way. No, 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 no. Like, Carver's gonna come in, he's gonna like, he's gonna come into the prison area. He's gonna be like, I know what you did. Boom. Yeah. That's what's gonna happen. I'm so glad I played this today. I was feeling kind of salty when I was playing Uncharted earlier. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Trust fall. We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? You little devil. Everybody stay where you are. No need drawing suspicion. That was so cool. You didn't even Thank see you. it. <laughs> I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. I like her. Thanks. Yep. Name's Jane. Anyway, get some rest. I didn't catch her name before that, honestly. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things he did that have a dumb face. Always the dumb things. He Same, was yeah. He was a dumb piece of he shit. He was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he just run. He couldn't stop him. Maybe that's why he died. Makes it harder to remember. He was a good boy. Oh. I'm old. Well, long. I'm only upset about Duck because Kenny's upset about Duck. It was like sad, but like I never really liked Duck, so but I'm sad that Kenny's sad, you know. Hey tomorrow. One long day. <coughs> I hope to have this episode out in like five hours, but not sure if that's gonna happen. Oh wait, maybe I should put Uncharted out first. It's such a boring episode, and I'm not very fun during it. I was just kind of like grumpy the entire time. This has put me in a good mood, though. All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's I'll do doing it. what before we. Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going, to work. Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane, if you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, 
Troy's coming for the rest of you. I thought there were holes in, the, like, all right, look, gaps in there. If we're gonna do something, not. we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should mm -hmm. do it. Are you fucking kidding? I do everything else. Oh, see. No offense. Yeah, okay. Come on. That's crazy. She's I like, thought there were gaps in that garage door thingy. Uh, they're not. Okay. Kid, why would there's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm trusting her. Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. I already have she respect. Need you. <laughs> Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. And don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. Yes, sir. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Gonna get Wasn't your tags all, all snagged on something. Yeah, Let's not go. suspicious at all. <laughs> I, not suspicious at all. It's just fucking hanging there. She might be able to, like, put it in her back, like, in the back of her pants. Like, you know, like, I don't know. Her shirt would hide it and her jacket would hide it better. I don't know. In her pocket. Eh. Oh, if only she was old enough to wear bras. She could just stuff it in her bra. She's with me. Oh, shit. I almost forgot. Yeah. Tension. Ooh, I love me some tension. Well, take her then. I don't care. Jesus. Wait, wait, what's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, City Mouse. Okay, this kind of ruins our plan. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. But it's nothing that'll hurt her. Won't they need my help? Well, today I need it more. You're being cheerful, Come on. but that kind of puts a damper in our plans to be H. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. That's kind, but we had plans. When you told me about Reggie, I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse, but Bill was just so matter of fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something, like it had to be done. And that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Goose pimples up and down your arm. Because it turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? You know you can talk to me, right? I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on oh. everything holy that'll never happen again. You can trust me. Bonnie, Luke's waiting for me to give this to him. He needs it. Clementine. Oh, fuck. And all I need from you is to just not care where I am for 15 minutes. Bonnie's gonna let us do it. I think she's gonna let us. She feels guilt. She wants to make up for it. If you get caught and you mention my name, Carver will be the okay. least all of right. troubles. Okay. All right. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? All right, let's do it. I made the right choice. Okay, I forgive Bonnie completely, which means she's probably gonna fucking die by the end of this episode. Yeah, not suspicious. Maybe we should like walk around like like we own the place, so we're less suspicious instead of like sneaking, you know. But again, that's just me. I'm so glad we're playing this, guys. I was so cranky after Uncharted. It was just like a frustrating episode with that game. Jesus Christ. Y'all better hurry that shit up. I hate babysitting you assholes. Luke. Psst. Luke. <sighs> Luke. Oh wait. Oh. Where 
I maybe see that's his like blood or something. Maybe it's old. I don't know. That looks really old. Yeah, okay. He's probably fine. I just saw someone out there. Fuck. No thanks. Luke, if you're hiding, come out. I don't know, like Luke. I swear to Christ you're gonna regret this. I was Fuck. You ain't supposed to be out here. Oh no. Fuck. Wait. You people been here one I fucking fucked day up. And already you're fucking up. Well you wait and see what happens. Move! Hey! Okay. That didn't go well. This is something I did. It was probably something I did, wasn't it? Maybe I just didn't check fast enough. I saw the people lay out there. Ah! I thought it wasn't one of those like risky moments. It was just I had to find Luke and then I fucked up. Oh, Dash, what happened? And how is it that we're repaid for our trust? With treachery? Music in the background. With deceit? Theft? Did you know about this? Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Oh no. He's gonna ask for the other walkie-talkie. Here, he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start. By telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't in my hand by then, We'll have to make things more difficult. I don't know what to do. Oh, I really don't. Oh, fuck. One. Two. Maybe you. It's right here. I got it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Kenny, what'd you do? If they kill Kenny, Sorry. I'm not continuing this game. I'll be done. Sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. Oh, I should have. Mm, I should have let Kenny do it. I should have let. Hang. He would have forgiven me more than he would have forgiven. <laughs> Fucker. No. 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 Fuck. No. No. Fuck. I should have given it up. <sighs> you have to do this, Bill. No. Stop it. Kenny. Kenny. Sure, these folks won't get into any more trouble. Yeah. Okay. No supper for y'all tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. And we'll try this again tomorrow. Why hasn't he killed us yet? Do your best with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. Oh, interesting. Interesting development. We're leaving tonight. How? Oh. Oh, Bonnie's... Oh, she's she's grown some fucking balls. Oh, I like this. Oh, I like this a bunches. Uh, ow. Dang it. It makes me so sad to see Kenny getting hurt that way. I feel like such shit. I really want to know what would have happened if I had just given it up instead of Kenny. What'd she say? She said she can get us out of the pen if we get the PA system going. The second she hears it, she'll run over and spring it. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. I was hungry. I got reckless trying to steal some food, and I got caught. Why isn't it great? Because most of us are beat to shit, or pregnant. And besides that, it's risky as hell. 
It is pretty damn risky, guys. Well, what's the alternative? We just Wish fucking you, stay here? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? The, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. It's all set the up. Hiccups. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do Where's your ear, though? Yeah, but now we're dealing with the guy beat to shit. So I mean, here. I noticed that his ear was gone like a while back, but I never like asked questions about it. Like, I want to know the story behind that. I'm in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, we should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time. And we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreeing to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. I don't know, guys. Luke's making sense. Maybe <sighs> we should wait. We're not waiting. <gasps> Says you. Ain't nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I've looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. I'm just saying we gotta be sensible about this. I don't wanna... This is being I don't sensible. wanna say anything. Where's Kenny? Doc's over there working on it. And don't look good. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Can I see him? I don't think that's a good Why? idea. Why? His orbiter is crushed. I don't think are there's we, much hope we, for No! Him. I got him as stable as I could, cleaned it, got some of the swelling down, bandaged it as best I could. But until he wakes up, we won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about gold tonight, then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe... Leaving some folks behind. Oh uh, no! There is no other way. This is bullshit. Oh shut up, Becca. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. Kenny and I are only here because of you people. And now you intend to leave us behind. So we should risk all of our lives? What are you We're saying? not leaving Kenny. Nothing. Let's I'm, I'm let's leave behind. Okay. No, okay. We're not Let's leave behind. I've never liked Becca. I'm sorry. She's just been kind of annoying. Maybe it wasn't her fault with the whole Carlos and Alvin thing. Maybe it was. I'm not in a position to judge that. But she's always she's always going to be looking out for herself. And I don't think there's a whole lot of, like, selflessness in her. And part of that is maybe she's just trying to protect her kid. But, like, I just, I don't like the woman. Let's leave her. I don't know. Like, I don't think Carver's going to mistreat her as much as he might mistreat other people. You know, like... I don't know. I just think, like, out of everybody, Becca might have the easiest time here. I don't know, but, the, like, I don't really know the backstory, so, I mean, I guess I can't really say, but I don't really want her to Even come. Kenny. That's not fair. We stay together. Life ain't fair, Clem. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. No one wants to leave Kenny. Well, I'm not going anywhere without him. Because he won't have. I'm all right. I can cry. <laughs> we leave tonight. Plan don't change. What a trooper. Not bad, old man. Thanks, <laughs> asshole. He's you gonna be fine. Tough bastard. <laughs> Do tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? You all right? That wasn't your fault, okay? So don't go blaming yourself. It's all right. Alright. Well then what now? We get the hell out of here. Like now now. Yes. Okay, I'm good. Where are we going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we need a place to meet up. We can meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. Got signs all over. Just follow the road. We stopped there after we escaped the first time. Luke and Carlos know where it is. It's not that far. Well, at least if a few folks know where it's at, it'll be easier to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bother to explain who's supposed to do that. Oh, that's me. Fucking fantastic. Wait, wait, hold on. She's the plan? <laughs> I'm gonna need a boost. Be sure to remember to flip the switch for the outdoor speakers. 
just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. By default, it's set to play music, so you should just have to turn it on, right? Then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. Down into the office. Outdoor speaker switch. Turn on PA. Up to the roof. Down into the stock room to meet you guys. I'm not very good at directions. I I don't even remember what they just said twice. They said it two times. I still can't fucking remember. Oh no, this is not gonna be good. Okay. Uh, switch for outside speakers. PA system. Stock room. Why? I'm not fucking responsible for all of these people. What about me? I'm so busy taking care of everyone else. I, I want to know what happened between Alvin and Carver specifically, because, like, I know they're fighting over Becca, right? Like, but what specifically has happened? Let's see. It concerns me that the game, like, specifically asked us to repeat the directions. Alvin! I mean, do we have time for this? We'll leave him if we have to. Wait, is he dead? Is he a walker? Where's his eye? Alvin, no, wait, he has an eye. He's just sleeping. Are, are you okay? Well, I'm gonna have to leave you. Bye. I don't got time for this shit. Okay, now the mic. Wrong. No, 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 Wait, no. Did I do something wrong? Oh, no. Fuck. Where are they? Oh, my God. Come on, come on. Please work. Run. Fuck. Oh, it's Alvin. Okay. Alvin? Wh what's wrong? Carver talks all the tough guy shit, then keeps the tiniest gun in the universe. <laughs> There's something funny about that. Damn it, he's alive. Now we have to take him with us. Have the project. We have the know-how. How? Come on, we have to go. I ain't going anywhere, but you are. Go on. I mean to get some payback. No, we're leaving. We're all leaving. I ain't fit to move, kid. I've, I've run out of room. I don't want to leave him behind. I mean. But, no, I'll, I'll just go up there. Ugh. I know I said I wanted to leave him, but now he's awake. I can't leave him when he's awake. Ugh. You take care of my girls. Oh. I get the Fuck me. It's going to be a girl. No. Just a hunch. Go on. Oh no. <laughs> Be my guest. But I will put a bullet in you and that bitch. Destroy him. Get no, back. just shoot him. Like, I don't give a fuck. Like, literally just shoot him. Why are you hesitating? Shoot him! Come on, Luke. This shoot him in the fucking head. Clem, where? Why is it Okay, don't focus on that bitch. I literally don't have time to deal with your bullshit right now. Like, fucking shoot him. 
Why y'all hesitating? Shoot him, oh. you dumb bitches. Like, why is this... Rebecca, I am... Oh, God, I am so sorry. Kill him. Yeah, exactly. Kill him. Rebecca, Rebecca, sweetie, my God. How did we get here, you and me? This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. Shoot him. Shoot him. Just shoot him. What? No, I can't... Uh, we'll shoot him in the head. Shoot him one more time. Well, now he's like... Now we're... Make it a quick death. Like, Jesus, people. Don't drag it out. <laughs> That's not humane, even for... Oh, no. Hilo Diamonds. And wait outside. We have to go. Kenny, please. Kenny, we don't really have time for this. I know you want to torture him, but Can you just shoot him in the head real quick, like Go on. You don't need to see this. That girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just gonna let him do this? Yes. There ain't one part of that son of a bitch I don't hate, but that does not make this right. I don't want nothing uh, to do with this. I'm not going anywhere. It's gonna get messy. I know. Look at you, you fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. That's all right. You'll learn. Lambs to the slaughter. No shepherd to guide you. Clementine knows exactly what I'm talking about. Come on. Come on, Clem. Fucking big man, huh? Let's go. I guess I'll just leave. Oh, come on, Clementine. Don't be like that. Don't run away. You know you want to see the show. Who do you think you're fooling, huh? I know you. No, you don't. <laughs> We're just tough. You're an asshole. Let the sheep out of the pen. We'll see how long that lasts. I'll be right there. You won't see anything. That's funny. Coming from you. <laughs> it is kind of funny. How's Sorry. I? Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a big fucking skull. Kenny. Should have put you out of your misery right then. Now look at you. You're I mean, mess. Clementine's tough. We don't need to make her tougher by like watching someone oh they could have just shot him in the head like i don't agree with that like he's a piece of shit kill him shoot him in the head but like why make him suffer like this i mean i'm not a huge fan of making people suffer like kill them when necessary and then just don't drag it out like that's i don't know if i was a shitty person and i had to die because i was a piece of shit like i'd i'd rather die quickly i don't know that's just me though <laughs> Not the Kenny I know in there. I wish I thought I could save him. This is a great way for him to take out his anger, though. Like, I don't know why y'all are so upset. He literally killed people. Nah, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm Carver's on. a piece of shit. We got Stop being worry. upset over his death. Man, we're never gonna make it. Not with this. that attitude. <laughs> you kidding me? If Clem can handle it, you can. Shit. I thought they were coming from the Cover south. yourselves in guts. Looks like we're in the eye of it now. Fuck. This is fucked. He looks like Omid for like two seconds. He looked like Omid. Thanks. Just kill one zombie and smother yourselves and all sorts of wonderful zombie guts. Smother yourselves! There we go. Okay, they'll be attracted you to that. You guys better hurry up and get to smearing if you want to live. Or you can die here. I'll go first. You're gonna put that on You dumb bitch. What am I, what, what, what else am I gonna do? I mean, if Sarah died, like, I guess it wouldn't be the end of the world. Now I'm just being a fucking hypocrite. Like, I'm like... <laughs> Sarah's so weak. She should die. But then it, that makes me no better than Carver. I mean, I don't want Sarah to die. I don't think she should die. I just think she needs to toughen up and stop being a dumb bitch. Like, sounds so mean. I'm sorry. I just... 
after everything that she's seen up to until this point, like, she shouldn't be, like, surprised about smearing zombie guts. Like, do you want to survive or do you want to die? Smear the guts. Stop complaining. <laughs> stop asking dumbass questions. Okay, now you. I guess she didn't have a Lee, like we did. Gross. Shut. Everybody shut the okay, fuck honey. up. Just cover. stay still. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. There's nothing to fear if you remain calm. I'll keep you safe. Hurry the fuck up. Turn around. I'll get Everyone you back. should have been raised by a Lee. See, we're prepared to survive in this world. Sarah, she wouldn't last one day we by herself. Stay here. Everybody ready? They're almost all us in the actual fuck is going on here. What is this sick shit? Someone say something before I start. Hey, 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 hey. Don't you even fucking think about it, motherfucker. I will end you. You hear me? Troy. Troy, we talked about this. What the fuck you talking about? I told you I wanted to get out. You said you'd help, then I'd help. I thought you meant get out of the pen. Not whatever the fuck this shit is. I did. But now we can leave. Troy, you can come with us. What? Well, where would we go? Away from here. Together. Man, you smell really bad. You gotta get a bath before we- ah! <laughs> You shot my dick off! Oh, did he say he shot my dick off? Hear something they don't like, and for fuck's sake, I feel walk. so bad for Troy though. Act like you belong, and you will belong. I I didn't like him, but I it makes me so sad when people suffer. Okay, leave Sarah behind since she's literally just being dumb. Like, we got this, y'all. Sorry, that's mean. Sarah's walking. I'm proud of her. Where's Bill? We need him up here. Well, they're gonna accidentally gun us down. Ooh, what if they kill Sarah? I mean, that's that would be so sad. Watch Sarah. Why do I have to watch Sarah? Quiet, honey. Clementine, come help me. Calm her down, please. Just say something. You're her friend. Shut up. I'm recording. I love you. Clementine. Oh! Look at that ugly one. Who died? Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, maybe I made a wrong decision there. Okay. I didn't quite expect it to go that badly. Help Sarah with her chores. Told Bonnie about Luke. Hmm. Admitted to stealing the walkie-talkie. <sighs> Watched Kenny kill Carver. Wow. Chopped off Sarita's arm. Damn! Kenny's gonna have to go through all that pain again. I don't want him to lose another partner. God damn it. Oh my lord. 
that was a lot. Oh my sweet goodness. <laughs> that was, uh, that was quite a bit. I'm really looking forward to playing episode four though. Like, oh my God, I can't. Okay, I hope you guys had fun watching this. I had a lot of fun playing this. It really brightened up my mood today. And until the next episode of whatever we're doing, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye guys. Bye.